When you push, 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 you need to do this because the quarter's getting ready to end, the month is getting ready to end, the week's getting ready to end, the promotion's getting ready to expire, and all of that happens, the month, the quarter, the week, and the promotion expires, that customer typically comes back and goes, hey, we're ready to go now. And I've got an email from you dated three weeks ago with X price, I'd like the other price. And now you're in a, do I want to get the business, right? Once you pull the trigger, bang, on that, letting them know about the promotion, you can't take that bullet back, right? And a lot of times we end up caving and giving them the price. I hope you don't do that. Which is why I want you to set yourself up when you're saying, hey, this promotion, instead of saying, if it ends, you're going to miss it, say this, hey, this is a limited thing, okay? This is the best we've seen it. It is going away. I want to be clear to you on that. Okay? We worked really hard to get this promotion out there. It's been clear to everybody that when it ends, it ends. Okay? If for some reason you don't catch this one, I will work with you and we'll find the next best promotion for you. We'll find the next best pricing for you. But I just wanted to be crystal clear about that. That when this ends, it does end and I won't be able to get you that level. As long as you're okay with that, I'm okay with you waiting and I will always work with you to find the next best deal at that time. But this one is limited and it is going away. Fair enough, right? And that's, and it sounds like, well, that's simple. It is, but we never do it. We always say the first half of the statement, Hey, I've got a great promotion. You got to do it now. I've got a great promotion. You've got to do it now. And what we've done is we've now lowered our price down to that level. And they're like, no matter what happens in the world, I'm always going to be able to get that price, which is why I'm not a fan of discounting, right? But let's say you guys were giving away a free reporting module or something. Listen, I wanted to let you know, we have a limited space on these reporting modules. We have a crystal clear time frame of when we're going to stop giving them away. And the last thing I want to do is communicate to you that that's an open thing. I want to be crystal clear with you right now. You have to purchase before Friday to get the reporting module. That being said, things happen. If you're not ready to make a decision and you don't make the decision before Friday, okay, you will not get the reporting module. I want to say that now, but I will do everything within my power to do something for you. I will work with you on getting you the next best alternative, but I have to be crystal clear. There is a hard stop 5 PM on Friday, mountain time zone and it's over. As long as you're okay with that hard stop, I'm okay with it, right? And now you're going to find that those people will come back to you on that promotion. The other, the flip side of that is if you just say the first half of that, got to do it now, got to do it now, got to do it now, they never do it now, right? And, and it becomes an issue. Make sure you back yourself up to be able to say, like we had spoke about, like I had put in the email to you, like I called you, that one was limited and it's gone. However, let's talk about what we can do for you right now. Okay. The price is ba 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 ba. Again, why I don't like going into, in, into price negotiations, because I, frankly, I don't think they work all that well. I think all it does is train that other person when we lower the price to go all oh, wait because the price gets better. The price is going to go lower and lower. You have to communicate to them that that's not going to happen best way to communicate to them that's not going to happen is to never lower your price. Um, but that's a story for another day. Make sense?